Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back. I am Phil, and my co-host here is Samantha. Hello, how are you guys? The lovely <laughs> Samantha. We are Bars and Barbells as a reaction channel, as you probably already know because you've already subscribed, because it's your favorite reaction channel, and if you haven't done that, well, you got to get on board here. Come on. <laughs> Uh, we've been doing reactions for quite a while. No, not really. Only like six months. Yeah. But we, uh, we've we really enjoyed it. And it's been great to open up our eyes. Fun. And part of that journey has been Britain's Got Talent. We've done a few performances from there. Yeah, some and, awesome you know, we, ones. Yeah, we started way back with Susan Boyle. Mm -hmm. That was mind-blowing. We did, uh, I think, Paul Potts was another one yep. on there. Jonathan and Charlotte, I think. Oh, uh, yes. I forgot about them. Um, some of them were from America's Got Talent, though. Yeah. I don't know which. I can't remember which ones were. Britain's There's been Got a Talent. mix of of different people so far, but yeah. they've all been incredible. And then we had even Marcelito went on America's yes. Got Talent, but he came from the Philippines. Got Talent. Yeah. So, anyways, we've been doing a few of these Got Talent shows. <laughs> this one is from 2023, and uh, so it looks like we got a young lad here that's gonna Aww. gonna do his thing. Not really sure what to expect, oh, but this was uh, seemingly trending on uh, a lot of social media platforms so one of the uh, best voices simon's ever heard yeah it says golden buzzer here so clearly he must do pretty well so yeah. uh excited to check it out we've really enjoyed these so when we've done them they were always yeah. blown our minds away so maybe he'll do and the same and i love they always have like a cute little story that yeah, goes they along do. with them yeah so cute all right you ready to check it out yes let's do it let's do it let's see the cool My name is Malachi, I'm 13 years old and my big dream is to be a singer. I started singing at 7. My mum made me join the choir because she's very bossy. <laughs> my mum's my biggest fan and we're very close. My baby on Britain's Got Talent. Wow. Yeah. Malachi is a sweet child. He plays tough but he's very emotional. Hi ladies. Are you ready to come to the auditorium? When he's on that stage, I'm just going to be pinching myself. You're not even the one on stage. Why are you petrified, man? <laughs> it just scares me because on his very first show, somebody heckled him. It was gutting to think that someone would boo a child on stage because it could have knocked his confidence completely. Are you ready to go? Yeah. You wanna follow me? Bro, it didn't, thank God. When my mum watches me in the audience, I think she'll be very nervous. Oh, hoping I can get through it. <laughs> Come on, let's do it. Okay. Best of luck. On to the star. Have fun out there, Malachi. Okay. Enjoy. All the best. How are you? Very excited. Good. And what's your name, please? Uh, my name is Malachi. I'm 13 years old and I'm a singer from London. Ooh. Okay. Oh, my gosh. When did you decide, Malachi, that you were going to be a singer? When I was seven. What happened? I joined my choir. Yeah. And then what? And then I started singing. Yeah. <laughs> So this is what you want to be full time? Yeah. That's why you're here? Yeah. Who have you brought with you today, darling? Uh, my mum and my sister. They're in the audience. Hello, ladies. All right, no more questions, I promise you. Good luck. Oh, please be good.
just a remarkable, he remarkable. He was like the most angelic voice. Like, I can't believe that little being just produced that. Yeah, it, like you said, angelic, I, I think, is the only way that you can summarize that to be, you know, you think of like a gospel, a yes. church, or something, yes, and it's ex- like, you know, you could, <laughs> if you wanted to put a voice to something in a movie or something, like, you know, this epic church, you know, mm-hmm. or spiritual awakening yes. or whatever. You know that that would be it, and obviously, I think that would fall into the category of the opera side of things as well. But yes. to be doing this at that age, it's just the clarity in his voice is oh, remarkable. Yeah. It's just unblo- um, unbelievable. I was going to say unblowing, like <laughs> my mind is blown. <laughs> yes, and it is blown, so I can't apparently speak properly. But uh, yeah, un- just, unbelievable. I like can't even fathom. I was like, how is this coming out of this little yeah. little child? But like, he's insane and. That's exactly what I thought, like very church choir, like um, gospel, like it even reminds me, I mean, I guess that could be tied into um, religious or I guess gospel based songs, but like, you know, some of the very like higher pitched Christmas music that you hear that like they, that I guess goes around the church and stuff. Um, it's what it reminded me of too, right? Yeah, I mean, not to get like get into too much of a religious, you know, rant or anything no, like that, no, no, no. but like it's just I the sound that you hear. No, I was just gonna say that it reminds me of like if you would say anything is related to God, like it just sounds like a song for or a sound from God. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like all I could think of when he was singing was like he sounds so angelic. Yeah, and um, you know his uh, not to mention you know his attitude coming out, you yeah. know, just fun loving. Not nervous at all, you know, just excited. He literally said, I'm excited, yeah. which is great to see. And now we've got him with a big smile on I his know. face. And his which, mom and his sister are so cute. Yeah, which is always, you know, amazing to see that, you know, young kids with dreams, you know, being able to fulfill them and, you know, uh, achieve something that they really, really want in life. And at an early age, is I think, great always to see because, you know, kids are, they don't have any malicious intent. You know, it's like, you know, they're doing it for all the right reasons. And so it's great to see them be successful. And so we haven't gotten to the gold bu- golden buzzer yet, but uh, I guess maybe that might be coming. Are you yeah. ready to check it out? Yes. All right, let's do it. Set by a river and it made me complete. Okay. Malachi. Is there any one word I could use to describe that? Golden. Totally flawless, very composed. I looked over at your mum and sister. They were in bits, so you did you did yourself so proud, it was beautiful. I don't know what you're channeling, but whatever is pouring out of you was so heavenly and beautiful. I actually went into a, a trance. I agree. It was like being in heaven. 
that was stunning, but that was effortless. I was in tears because you really touched me and it's very simple. You sang like an angel. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you for coming on this show. Really, that means a lot. Thank you. Yeah, I mean, you know, great attitude, like we said. Like, just, you know, it's like, he's just like, cool. Yeah. <laughs> this is cool. He's like, I'm here to sing it. I got to sing it. Everybody yeah. loved it. Apparently, I did a good job and everybody loved it. All right. I know. No I know. problem with that. It also is just crazy because all those judges basically said what we were saying, right? Like, yeah. heavenly, angelic, like, you know, just so beautiful. And that's exactly what it was. Yeah, it got into a frequency that I don't know if I've heard. Yeah. Ever or uh, often, for sure. That's you know very very rare. So um, unique talent and um, awesome job, Malachi. Yeah, and uh, I think uh, Simon was saying he's like, thanks a lot. You you know we really appreciate it. You you know coming on the show because you're gonna earn us some good dollars. <laughs> <laughs> you've got tons of talent. So yeah, um, it's wild to me that his mom said that someone was like making fun of him at a different performance. Like people are just always gonna haters. Yeah, I mean, there's always haters. and I give him a hundred thumbs up. <laughs> Hopefully you guys can give us a thumbs up as well. <laughs> if you enjoyed our reaction, hit us with a comment. Let us know what your thoughts are. Maybe how this one touched you as well as, you know, one of the judges, what judges were saying there. And for us, it was yeah. definitely a heavenly vibe, as they said as well. So if you felt the same way, let us know in those mm -hmm. comments. Uh, if you want to subscribe, this is your first time on the channel. We'd love to have you on this journey that way we've been going on. And if you want to be a part of it, you're more than welcome to. So uh, hopefully we see you tomorrow. Thanks for watching, guys. And we'll see you next time.